that's what they're there. Um, another friend of mine, Jason, but this is another friend of mine, I, I like him very much, and, and he asked me to do this whole thing where I'm just a complete bitch to him, and, and I, you know, I have a hard time playing these things, like on the Big Bang, I was so, you know, there's a fine line between playing yourself and then kind of like playing, making fun of yourself, and I, I would rather make fun of myself, I think it's a much more interesting thing to watch than actually, you know, do the, the other, so um, I thought it was really fun to sit there and just pretend like I was a complete brat, and and I, I find it hysterical all the time when people actually think that I am, and I'm like, awesome, I'm such a bad actor. <laughs> But I, uh, officer here. He was walking up with like a patch on his eye, and I actually thought, "Oh, you poor baby, what happened?" <laughs> and then I realized, "Are you salt eye?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just call him salty eye. It's in the bracket shit. <laughs> um, I'm a bit of a Battle Star Galactica fan from the old school, and uh, when it came to the screen, I uh, saw so that. Um, Starbuck had a sex change, and I was very offended, and I had to turn it off straight away. And then uh, someone I had went through counselling saying uh, that you can't compare the two. You know, just just admire the last one. That's good, but this is a new move forward sort of thing. So I, I stopped and gave it a, a second turn, and I, I really enjoyed the end product and loved the four seasons, Blue Road, the whole deal. Um, but was there any? Um, I heard rumours for one that Starbuck originally was supposed to be female, even from the one in the 80s. Was that true? No? I would say no. I okay. highly doubt that. I highly doubt that. Yeah. It, it wouldn't, I don't think that it would have been um, it, like widely appreciated on television at the time to have female fighter pilots. Yeah. So I, don't, I, I just don't, I don't know. It was a different time on TV. I mean, I don't mm. know why I was born. I'm assuming it was like... <laughs> Uh, no, we liked women in uniform back then too, so... <laughs> yeah. Well, they kind of made them feminine anyway. So. <laughs> uh, secondly, was there any parallels there that you uh, took from that, that, that Starbuck and said, oh, I can apply that? Like, uh, you know, you did have a, a cigar there at one stage in sort of not too many times, maybe. I would have liked you to see you know, more cigar action, personally. But, um, but was there anything that you personally wanted, uh, that, that you drew from that character, or was it like totally, you know what, that's that Starbuck, I'm creating my own Starbuck, or you were told to go this way with your Starbuck character? You know, um, the thing about our show, which was amazing, was we had as actors so much freedom to do whatever we wanted. On Friday nights, I would talk myself out of scenes so I could make the plane home. Um, so, I mean, really, I mean, there were scenes where I was supposed to be in them, and I was like, I don't think that Starbuck would be in this scene. I think she'd be hung over. And they were like, yeah, okay, that makes sense. I'm like, awesome, see you later. <laughs> um, I said all the time, I was so good at it. Um, so as far as the, where Starbuck went, I, I do believe that, that with the writers, that was all kind of us. We just kind of like said, I want to do this, and they were like, go for it, do whatever you want. The reason Starbuck stopped smoking the cigars was because I didn't want to smoke them anymore. I thought it was very phallic. Um, it was phallic. I mean, especially the miniseries. Go back and watch it. Are you kidding? Really? Um, and <laughs> so, um, but I watched the original for about ten minutes, and then I turned it off. Um, because I knew at that point that I, I didn't want to try and make her him. Because I was never going to be able to do it. And I didn't want to have subtleties that people saw. And, and so anytime people were like, yeah, she did this thing, and it totally, I, I guarantee you, she copied it from that. And I'm like, no, because I never watched it. Um, because I really wanted to make this character my own. I thought that, that was the only way to, get, to do it justice, was to just recreate this completely. And um, um, yeah, I mean, if you go back and watch the miniseries, you'll actually notice that I'm a lot more masculine in the miniseries than I am in the series. And the reason being was that people had already started talking really, really badly about all of us online, especially Starbucks. And I kept saying, um, hello, Boomer. No? Anyone? Anyone? Um, but I, 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 I lost my train of thought because I started thinking about Greg and Boomer. Sorry. Um, so I actually took it too far, because at that point I was like, oh my god, nobody thinks that I can do this as a woman. And so I went, okay, I'll show them. And I went way too far in the miniseries. I made her so masculine, and it was all about insecurities of, uh, from, from my own perspective as far as what I was actually going to be able to do with this character. Um, I'd been acting for, for, you know, almost like 
ten years at that point, but I, I didn't believe in myself because I got caught up in what everyone was saying online. And if somebody, you know, it takes a hundred positive comments to get rid of one negative one. So um, I, I went too far. And then I watched the miniseries and went, wow, I just went way too far with that. So I pulled her back and started making her more feminine um, in the first series. And then I found a happy medium about like episode, you can't go home again, was when I think I really found that, that nice, where I found her. I really found her. That scene with Eddie, when I walk out of the room and I'm like, hands over the head, crying after I told him I killed Zach. Um, at that moment, something clicked and I went, I get it. And I finally, in that moment, found her and just never had any more doubts after that. So, it was a very long-winded answer. <laughs>